some of my speeches, not today, before, that I'm working on an Islamic movie. So can you have an Islamic movie, it's halal? It is possible, but very difficult. If it's an Islamic movie following the Quran and Sunnah, number one, they should see to it that it follows the rules of the Sharia. And if you strictly follow, then but naturally there should not be any music. Number one. Number two, but naturally you can't have females acting in that. Because that's against, even if they are wearing hijab, you see a lady on the screen. So that breaks the purpose of hijab. So if you follow the rules, it's possible, but very really difficult. So if you ask me, are there any Islamic movies available? There are, there are some, but very few. And the good quality ones are there, but they haven't followed all the rules of the Islamic Sharia. For example, the best movie that I know, the so-called Islamic movie that has been produced so far, it is the message made by Mustafa Akkad, in which Anthony Quinn was one of the lead roles. He acted like one of the uncles of Muhammad Sallallahu Alaihi Wasallam. They never showed the photo of Muhammad Sallallahu Alaihi Wasallam, alhamdulillah, which is perfectly fine. They did not show the image of any of the Fokhul Farashidin, but they did show the images of certain Sabahs, which is objectionable. But amongst the so-called Islamic movies, that was made the best. Then you have the Umar series, which is a 30 series made by BBC, funded by the Qatar Foundation. That's also beautiful. Again, there is music in it, but it is not obscene movie. So amongst the so-called Islamic movie, which is breaking the Islamic principle, but less as compared to others, would be these. They, they, they don't show anything which is obscene, but yet it is breaking the Islamic. And I, as a person, when I do something, I don't believe in 90% Islamic or 95%. If I do something, I believe 100%, I don't do it. So we were at a time, I was thinking whether we should make or not. And I was thinking of making a movie on Imam Bukhari. I want to take a personality which is accepted by all the sects of Islam, the Ahl Sunnah wal Jamaat. So I thought that Bukhari would be a good one because he is revered by Hanafi, Shafi, Hanbali, Malki, Mashallah. And Salafi. So there was at one time, but now we have got better projects and important projects. So I don't think so I'll be going for that project.